Centrifugal pumps are the most commonly used rotodynamic pump. A centrifugal pump converts rotational energy, from a motor, to energy in a moving fluid. Design of a centrifugal pump The impeller is a rotating component equipped with vanes or blades used in centrifugal pumps. The impeller attached to a shaft that is driven by the motor. Bearings restrict the movement of the shaft and reduce the friction of rotation. The liquid flows through the suction nozzle. The volute of a centrifugal pump is the casing that receives the fluid being pumped by the impeller, slowing down the fluid's rate of flow. The discharge nozzle is a diffuser connected to a high-pressure line. The components of the impeller are shown in the figure. How does the centrifugal pump work? Centrifugal force pushes the liquid outward from the eye of the impeller where it enters the casing. A centrifugal pump converts rotational energy to energy in a moving fluid. A portion of the mechanical energy goes into kinetic energy of the fluid. Fluid enters axially through eye of the casing, is caught up in the impeller blades, and is whirled tangentially and radially outward until it leaves through all circumferential parts of the impeller into the diffuser part of the casing. The fluid gains both velocity and pressure while passing through the impeller. In the volute casing tap and diffuser, the flow rate decreases, and the pressure increases.